I'm gonna make it to the top, leave a legacy If I got something to say, you better let me speak Turn it up a new degree, bitch, you ain't seen anything I pop off with the new rock Electronic, blow the sonic roof up I'm too honest when I take a few shots They're too toxic, need to take the new song What's going on, everybody? Yeah, we're live with a Wednesday night show. Yeah, yeah. Welcome, welcome. What's up, everybody? Yeah. Commentary tonight, commentary tomorrow. We got seven matches I'm going to run tonight, and then seven matches tomorrow. I figured uh, we'd just do a two-night go-home show. Tomorrow will be spin wheels in most of the promos. Um... I'm trying to load up the promo for Shane for tonight. So hopefully it works. I didn't test it beforehand. So we'll see. But welcome everybody. Episode 816 NAW. We're doing 7 tonight, 7 tomorrow. And a rivalry match here. Thorn building up his darkness. Having raided it with what could be a tryout match for them to face off against Hydra. And thank you, Thunder. Thank you all for randomly just tuning in with minimal notice. <laughs> uh, but yeah, seven matches tonight. We got some house show matches. Uh, only one contender match tonight, and that's the tag contender. And then a championship match tonight for the Twitch. So, uh, I don't know how long the show will be. I'm assuming it's going to be a short show, but more time for tomorrow than with you all. So, welcome. This is a first pinfall submission situation here. 
I move my camera around, it's changed my setup, so this is going to be weird to get used to. What's up, Connor? How you doing, man? What's up, Troy, Emma, Thunder, Ty, Chris, Seth, Shane? Who'd I miss? I think it's everybody so far. You were curled up in bed? <laughs> you know, I, I, I didn't know what to stream tonight, so um, I was like, screw it. Why not? The NPC general manager in the house, um, he's got his first card coming. We might do that as soon as tomorrow afternoon. Is that cool, Thorne? I might be taking Friday off work. That's that's the reason why, because my kid doesn't have school, so I might not be working. Help Nate with home. No, hey, no worries. Like I said, this was kind of impromptu, so I, I didn't know. I didn't know if anybody would show up, to be honest with you. But thank you all for tuning in so far. We got seven matches tonight. R busy bringing in the groceries. Hey, good luck with the new job, Thorne. New GM job for NPC. New actual in real life job. Man. Thorne's going places, you guys. It's a rivalry match here for Hydra. And the darkness that is Thorne. Uh, it doesn't look like you're going to be able to... Hey, no worries, Seth. I'm picking up UFC. Maybe we'll do something on here. We'll see. Championship matches tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow we have a tag championship match and the NAW championship match. So two title matches tomorrow. We got beat the clock tomorrow. Uh, NAW contender, DNA contender, and another NAW contender. So tomorrow's really stacked too. So I'm looking forward to tomorrow as well. He said maybe three. Uh oh, Troy. Uh oh, I'll see. He said, hmm. Briggs on the outside with a submission hold. You can't win on the outside, though. That's the problem here. You got to bring him in. So you can try all you want. It's not going to be very effective. The darkness suits Thorn. Big slam for Thorne on the outside. Dumped into the ring is Briggs here. Rhino deciding not to follow here. Is Briggs going out ringside? Rated again. What looks could be what looks like it could be a tryout match for him. Briggs setting up Rhino. Laid out here. Will he go for a cover? Distraction on the outside though. Cyclops and Garmer. Double team effort. Garmer in the ring now. And again, welcome everybody to 816 as you find your seats. Special Wednesday night edition bonus episode. Um, I had to make up an episode anyways because I uh, ended Legends House one episode early. So this keeps me on track to what I had planned. So this, this really works out. Rated approached you and said he wanted to know the darkness. Interesting. Well, this is a good tryout match for him. And right now he's not doing too great. Laid out by Garmer. What's up, Icon? Pinfall attempt. Garmer here. Thorn saving rated. Interesting. I guess he does want him to do well. Pinfall attempt here. Cyclops. Hydra picking up the win here tonight, though. Cyclops picks up the pin. Congratulations to them. But again, welcome everybody. Last minute impromptu episode here for 816. I don't know how long this episode will go. We'll see. Might be an hour, might be an hour and a half. Might be 20 minutes. <laughs> Who knows? Here are your winners. The Ministry of Darkness. So congrats to Hydra here picking up a win. Big momentum as they head into our pay-per-view known as Sacrifice next week so next week eight days from now sacrifice our next pay-per-view event so tune in for that of course coming up next
Some of these are matches that y'all redeemed for house show matches. And you know what? You're getting a freebie here, having it featured on a live show with commentary. You just made so. the list. You're welcome for that. Let me get you your predictions in now. You think Ray Day broke up the pin? Shenanigans happening. Here we go, ringside. Porter and Yuri. And Shane Crow, aka Shane Michael, don't worry, I uh, loaded up your promo and we'll uh, we'll see if it works. So bear with me. Of course, the Twitch Championship on the line in the main event tonight, a 20-man rumble headlining our show tonight. Border looks ridiculous. You don't like the haircut? I'm curious about that. Yuri in control here. Guiding Border over to the ropes. Goes for the right. Border with a reversal, though. Sets him up for the bomb. Lands it. Planted out is Yuri here. Charity Seth. Why y'all hitting on Charity Seth? We, we can't do random acts of kindness and just be good wrestlers here. We, we, we get judged for doing good things. See, that's what's wrong with half this roster. You guys don't believe in the goodness. We are wrestling goods. That's all right, though. It's all right, Seth. Let him talk. You're still the billion-dollar champion, right? Praise the bad, curse the good. Yeah, it's it's like opposite day, Ty. I don't get it. I don't I don't get them. Colty, see see that's the thing. We're just good, and we get hated on. What's the point of being good anymore, then, huh? We sacrifice so much just to be kind, caring, and just good people. Oh man, is it worth it? Judgment Day apparently is upon us every week here. Pinfall attempt from Porter. Porter picks up the win over Yuri here tonight. Trying to sacrifice Ty. What would the benefit of that be? Explain to me. What, what would the benefit be to sacrifice Ty? Make it make sense. I don't. I don't. I don't understand the the logic here. What's the benefit of sacrificing anyone for the greater good of the cause? But why would we sacrifice our own? The sacrificial should be the non-believers. Those who throw stones. Come on. I guess they'll never understand, Ty. They'll just never understand. This is a contender match. The winning team will either block or advance to the pay-per-view in the women's tag team division. Will Dancing in the Rain prevail or will Becca and Taryn head to the pay-per-view? This is a tag team contender match for the pay-per-view. As of right now, the tag championship is Dancing in the Rain against Emma and Sophie in a two-on-two -two championship match. So if Dancing in the Rain wins this one, they block anybody from advancing to join them in that pay-per-view match. So get your prediction on. Well, you can't because I didn't post it yet. Let me do that. Becca and Taryn. There you go. Now you get your prediction on. Go for it. I dare you. But again, welcome everybody. Thank you for hanging out on this Wednesday night. NAW. In match three of seven already. Again, it's going to be probably a short show tonight. But um, it was either this or Alan Wake. And uh, if I were to do a poll, I think more of you would want to probably see this. So, And that's fine. But I appreciate it. Everyone's so kindly just popping in to hang out. 
Uh, over the weekend, be on the lookout too. It really depends on Amazon looking at you. Um, maybe a Spider-Man stream? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe. Next Monday, maybe Mario if it arrives on time. We'll see though. High risk move from Catherine on the outside, paying for it now. Taryn in the ring with a baseball bat. Becca Blay with a submission hold being applied to Catherine. Defiance is worse than an evil, this is a fact. It's true. I just rip into the buckle here. Taryn in trouble. Alyssa, the queen of the ring. That will be next week again, too. Keep that in mind. King and queen of the ring return next week. So tune in for those episodes. Did I get your Halloween attire? I, I got more today. I think I got like nine or ten more um, that I need to finish updating. But yeah, I, I got a bunch. So, I'll have it done by the Halloween show for you guys. I promise. But yes, NPC tomorrow. Mm -hmm. The debut of Thorne's show. Will there be a Halloween show? Like, on Halloween itself? Not that night. Because I'll be... It'll be family time. Maybe during the day. I don't know. We'll see. But Halloween night, nah. Yeah, the kiddos, man. It's, it's all about the trick-or-treating, and then we watch Nightmare Before Christmas every Halloween. So... So it's all about the candy. Did I check my DMs? Not all of them. It's been a busy week. I saw I had some. I'll get to them. Yeah, Nightmare Before Christmas is elite. I agree. NPC General Manager next week. It's going to be mayhem. So how about this, NPC General Manager? Do we run your... Uh pay-per-view on Halloween then instead of next Friday we move it to Halloween just bump it a few days later what do you think about that Thorne alright so during the day on Halloween we're going to have Thorne's pay-per-view episode tune in for that you have a special edition Nightmare Before Christmas still in the box? Like the VHS? Pinfall attempt here. Dancing in the rain, blocking Becca and Taryn from advancing to the pay-per-view here. The dominance of Dancing in the Rain continues. Every time they're questioned, they step up and they win. There's no denying that. A Jack Skellington box? Man, you want to sell it? <laughs> He's a hell of a dance time. Yeah, Nightmare Before Christmas is one of my favorite movies. I absolutely love that movie. So yeah, Dancing in the Rain prevailing here tonight. Coming up next, we got a rivalry match as this rivalry continues. Porter and Evans. We're just moving right along tonight, aren't we? Who will win? Porter. Evans. Who doesn't like... You know, there are people that don't like uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. I don't understand that. Um, and then there's also the debate on whether it's a Christmas movie or a Halloween movie. What do you guys think? Evan's starting out here, heading out to the apron, back into the ring. Oh, and he tripped him. Yeah, what do you guys think? Do you think Nightmare Before Christmas is it's a tweener movie? It's both? I mean, it does bridge the seasons and holidays. Probably don't like it because it's watched a lot during this time of the year there. Combination strike and a forearm 
connected by Porter. Oh, and he's just wiping his sweat on him. It does cover both holidays. You're, you're not wrong. Elbow from Porter. Making a combination strike, but a hip toss takeover there. Definitely both. I don't know. For me, it's Halloween tradition, so... Christmas, we watch things like Home Alone. Now that's that's a Christmas classic. What do you guys watch for the holidays? Actually spilling out ring sign. You get a break for it, man. I wish I had breaks. I don't get any time off or any of that stuff. I get Thanksgiving off. Home Alone easily, yeah, one of the best. It really is. Santa Claus movies with Tim Allen. You want Thanksgiving? I just want the food. Hell yeah. Grinch, that's a good one too. Nice clothesline, Porter. Sidewalk slam. Evans laid out here, the Grinch cartoon. I like the Jim Carrey one too, though. It's good. Pitfall attempt. Evans kicked it out at two there. His action continues. And Jim Carrey's great. I'm a big fan of his. He was really good as Robotnik in Sonic. I like those movies a lot. On the apron, a spear knocking Evans off the apron. Porter going ringside with him now. And a stomp across the right hand. As Porter looking for something. There you go, guys. I see you. With the redemption. Steel steps in the ring. And no worries, no worries. This is match four of seven. So, like I said, it's going to be a shorter show. This is just kind of a pop-up. So, hope you guys enjoy it. It'll probably go just around an hour, a little bit more. So, not the crazy long here. Working on the arms now as it continues. Oh! Snapping those arms of Evans. Evans trying to fight out of it and reverse out of it. But Porter maintains his aggression here. So, Evans, did you, did you film it and send it to me? Because it doesn't work in universe mode for whatever reason. I didn't see it in the, the, the Google Drive. Yeah, for whatever reason, it doesn't work in the universe mode. I don't know why, maybe it's my arenas. It, I mean, it is a match type, but it... Porter picking up the win here. It is a match type, um, but the problem with it is it always loads in the entrance ramp. It was that way in 22 and 23. Porter picking up the win in this feud so far, though. Holy crap. 49K was bet on that. Jeez. Everyone trying to get in those last-minute little predictions and, and throw it all in. I got to get faster, I guess. <laughs> Trying to outbid Alec. I see what y'all doing though. I see what y'all doing. Coming up next, this is another match that was scheduled for a house show, but we're getting it here tonight instead. So you're welcome for getting a, a match that was meant for a house show. It's, it's free, free upgrade. You were at 1,200 when you looked a few. What are you at now? And here we go, Eve Steele, Becca Blade, house show match that was scheduled. We're getting here tonight. You don't have to wait for this one now. 
Got it over to the ropes. Oh, the pot. Yeah, yeah, it went from 1,200 to like 40,000 real quick. Somebody just at the last second dumps it all in there because I'm not fast enough on ending the submissions. So they take advantage of it. <laughs> the, the constant ways that people find out how to exploit things here in NAW. I'm going to have to turn down the, the time from 10 minutes to something last. Do you guys make a lot, though, off that stuff? I got to ask. Like how much do you make off these? You all cheat on your taxes. <laughs> Everything's a business expense. You made 2K. Going back to exclamation. But that's a that's a throwback right there. You got 26K, Ollie? Good God. Like, <laughs> you put in 10. Oh, man. Yeah, we're going to have to figure something out here. Y'all crazy. I suppose anybody can do it, but... Damn. Don't I do any... I... Counts both your bet and your winnings. If you don't throw everything in and someone else does, you get like five credit and they get it all. Damn. I'm not... So what do you think, chat? Should I, I be better at ending it before the match ends so people don't do that? Should I shorten the time? Be faster? Pinfall attempt here from Eve. Should I end the submissions? Oh, I ended them. Oops. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm going to shorten the time. Y'all be cheating. I guess it's no. <laughs> Low the time to five. That's fair. Pinfall attempt here. Back up could pick up. No, a two count on Eve. That could go in high risk. Will it pay off? Elbow from the top rope. Leg is hooked. Two. A two count. Cody, you're not wrong. You've been here for, for a long, long time. You've seen all the various exploits. Hell, you've been a part of some of the exploits. <laughs> it happens. I mean, that's why we evolve. Pitfall attempt here from Becca. Becca picking up the win. You used to love the other way, though. You know, here's the thing. I'll never make everyone happy, so why try, you know? I'm going to just do the best I can and what I think is fair and what is right. That's just how I am and how I'll be. So. That's all right. If you, if you dwell on making everybody happy, you're just going to be sad yourself. You, you're talking about the strand system? That doesn't even exist anymore. Like, that's just gone, gone now. So here we go. Who will win? Let's take it down to five. So house show match that got upgraded to tonight. you love to see it. Me and Allie. Get your predictions in. Let's do five minutes now. Yeah, no more Chonk. The end of the Chonk era. That's sad. There are other really cool sound bites and redeems too. Like I'm, I'm super sad that those are gone. Yeah, the, the the random handouts. If you were in chat because I was just feeling a certain way, those were fun times. I remember like being in a good mood and I'm like, you just get a million because here you go, everyone. Yeah, those were those were the days. But then, like, everyone had millions, and it was just like, what do we do with this much? So, it got weird. Bonuses for voting the best for the night, yeah. It was, it was a lot, and it was a lot to track, too. 
Like it, it just was so much work. Pinfall attempt here from Grav on Ollie. And a one count. The random billion dollar title shot. Hey, you took advantage of that. And you won it, Seth. Oh, kicking a little dirt in Ollie's face. And another stomp here. Got wrench bomb set up. Boom. Sit down, power bomb. Why would a good guy be in it? I didn't book this match. Somebody wanted us to fight. Hey, I didn't book it. Somebody else booked it. High risk? No. Just messing with you. No high risk move there from Grav. Not today. Locking up. Off the ropes goes Ali. Tilt the world. Pile driver. And down he goes. Leg is hooked. A pinfall for Grav. And a one count again. So we already got our main event next. A 20 man over the top rope battle roll for the Twitch Championship. So tonight went quick. <laughs> we knew it would though. Again, it was just kind of a pop up bonus for y'all. Stomping out the leg of Oh, grab sizing up Holly here. Mr. Fluid just redeemed skip qualifier. Join contender. Oh, see, he doesn't. Even, he doesn't even Tarrant care. He's he's skipping. He's skipping. Nice slam here. That fisherman suplex. Chances have been waiting patiently. You have been. Nice forearm strike from Ollie here, wearing down Grav. Submission hold being applied now. Will Grav tap out to Ali? Former NAW champion Ali, of course, kicked to the midsection. Look at Emma for NAW. There you go. Everybody's skipping. Kick the midsection. Up. Oh, but a reversal here. Ollie reversing it. It's, oh! The backhanded compliment from Grav. And he kicked out of it. How did he kick out of that? Pressure delicious just redeemed spin the wheel match. Nice fisherman suplex there. Grab going high risk. We don't see this a lot. I don't like it. Get down, dude. Pressure delicious just redeemed spin the wheel. Plant it down. Grab standing Ollie back up. Kicking the midset. Oh! The choke out. Ollie taps. Ollie gives in and submits to Grav. Some highlights here. Here is your winner, the Fox, Travis James. I, I hurt Ollie. I did not. Hey, whoever booked the match, this is their fault. This is their fault. This is not my fault. I didn't do it. So, ladies and gents, it is time for the main event. Get your predictions in. The championship is on the line.
tomorrow. Tomorrow, can he do it? Can he do it tomorrow? That's a lot of gold. That's a lot of gold. It is main event time here. 20 men over the top rope Twitch Championship. Rumble. Here's the Royal Rumble match. Now, the two superstars that drew number one and number two will start the ring at the same time. Other superstars will join in in the order they drew. This will continue until all 20 superstars have entered the ring. Eliminations occur when you are thrown over the top rope with both feet landing on the floor. The last superstar in the ring will be declared the Royal Rumble winner. It might be a historical uh, of their choice. thing too. I don't think anyone's had that many titles at the same time. And here we go. 20 man rumble for the Twitch Championship. Who drew number one? Yeah, the most I ever had was three. Introducing the oh no. First, Evans drawing number one. Weighing in at 225 pounds. Jacob, the X Factor. Evans. That's not good luck. Yeah, Crow, tomorrow, I mean, a lot on the line tomorrow. Obviously, a huge opportunity, finally, for the NAW Championship. Money in the Bank is out of the picture, too, so you're not going to get interrupted there. You're getting a fair match against Briggs. So give the man who's still recovering the first entrance. Yeah. Can't wait to dump this dude over the top rope like you did a couple matches ago. You said pour her out, man. This guy. And yeah, tag titles on the line tomorrow. Who got number two, though? Yeah, yeah. I, Blueprint, you talk so much. That's your curse, man. You talk too much. Who's number two here? Santos coming in at number two. That's bad luck. So two members of a CeeLo here starting the match. The Tito propaganda. <laughs> Betting 9K to retain. That's a lot. Leave Tito alone. Tito's in this rumble. And here we go. 20 men over the top rope. For the championship. This is your main event. Twitch championship on the line. Evans squeezing the life out of Santos. Our remaining members of a CeeLo here. Starting the damn match. Counting down. A competitor has been eliminated. Wow. E-Rock coming in at number three. And Evans immediately eliminated. Unreal. E-Rock coming out here. I did not see that happening. He said, I want to restart. Yeah, that's wild. We're not even wasting any time here. E-Rock now trying to get Santos out of the match. Can he get rid of Santos? Alexander Scott coming at number four. Santos in trouble. I think Scott, Alexander Scott saved Santos there during his run in. We got three people in the ring, fourth entrant now. 
I just rip off the ropes. Imagine wrestling in a hat. It's impressive. It stays on. Keeping on. Yeah, it's, that's impressive. Trying to go for that uppercut. Santos unable to. Clothesline. E-Rock here with some nice momentum. A-Ron coming in at number five now. Super glue. He's just got like a string under his chin or something. Holding that thing on. Nine K has become small cash. I'm glad y'all got the money to spend. For a long time there, people said they couldn't earn it. So. Counting down who's joining us. Number six coming in is Bruno. We don't talk about him though. Twitch Championship on the line here in this one. Big right hand from Santos. E Rock off the ropes. A. Aaron ducking. Playing a little bit of rope game here. A. Aaron with the advantage of that exchange. Counting down who's going to be joining us next. Ring filling up nicely now. We're going to have six people in the ring. I Rob coming in at number seven. He said, Because of my swerve show, the Legends House Giver will tie into the pay per view show and be announced. There you go. That works. Sorry for the swerve. Sometimes you got to keep people on their toes here. Again, the alternative was playing Alan Wake, and I just didn't feel it tonight, so. Yeah. An elimination has occurred. Who was it? Aaron out of the match now. Counting down who's going to be joining us. Slash coming in at number eight. He should have been 13. Say out loud, say what out loud. Porter wins Twitch. I mean, he's not in the match yet. He could win it. Neither is the champion, though. So we don't know who's walking out with it. So as more come out, the champion has not entered. Champion's advantage, in my opinion. Cody coming at number nine. We've seen a rebirth of a career recently here. Ultimately, Money in the Bank cash and went to a tie, a draw, two to two in the Iron Hell against Briggs. They have a storied past. So an honest opinion, I don't consider that a major loss. A misstep in the resurgence, but he put up a fight. Slash eliminated here. Rhino coming in at number 10. Nasty chop. Look like Alexander Scott out of the match by Bruno there. So again, we have six active wrestlers in the ring currently. Emma says, we all hope you lose. <laughs> Damn. Right hand from Bruno. Pushing Irob back into the corner. Counting down who's going to be joining us. Irob in a precarious position here. Up top. Terrible. Tito. Coming in number 11 here. One of our rookies for NAW. He's been doing really big things in his opportunities. We look forward to seeing him grow here. Santos trying to get rid of E-Rock. Unable to do so. Ring now almost full. We are waiting on one more person coming out here. Elimination on the north side there for those that missed it. G-Dub gravity well in. Santos was eliminated. Coming at number 12, I don't like that, but I'll take it. Oh, spinning back fist. 
Learn that from you, Slash. He's taking down Cody here as he immediately goes after him. Going after his partner, I-Rob. Sorry, I-Rob, it's a rumble. No offense. What's up, Goofy? Bruno up on the shoulders of Grav, planting him down. I-Rob giving payback. Into the month tired. I did. I took a little bit of time off. What's up, Archie? How you been, man? Yeah, I took a little bit of time off. I've been helping others out. Do I think October's different? Rhino eliminated as Swag is coming down now. Jackpot is Archie greater than Seth. Jackpot don't miss a beat. I'm telling you. I went to war with Jackpot. He doesn't, he doesn't miss a step. Hopefully he got the, the battery changed. I hope so too. Cody now again working on grab here. The battery's going <laughs> stop it. Good lord. Cody continuing to, oh, swag eliminated by IROB. IROB now trying to sneak up on Cody here. Double team effort. Short-lived. Counting now who's going to be joining us. Number 14. Put your hands up. Ty is here. All three members of Grav, Little Eye, Ty, not a cult, is in the match. Archie, we're ready for you too, man. And die for you we shall, Ty. And everyone thinks that you're going to die for us. <sighs> These people. He says, since we're doing half matches tonight, will we get all entries tomorrow? Yeah, probably, I don't know. We'll see what tomorrow brings. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Grab eliminated here. It is the go show. The pay-per-view is where you get all the entrances. Those are the long ones. Hey, sometimes a reset is needed, Archie. Nothing wrong with that. Hercules coming in at number 15 now. Oh yeah, grab eliminate Hercules number 15. We still have yet to see the champion in the match. Fake news. What? Nah, you here. And here we go, counting down who's going to be joining us next. The number 16. Ty and Cody. Ollie coming at number 16. What the hell, Ollie? Combination, beautiful striking game here from Ty. Taking down Cody there, backing Hercules now into the corner. Need a Tito versus Ira up two out of three falls. <laughs> oh no, Cody eliminated Ty. Ty is out of the match. Twitch Championship on the line here, of course. The champion saying you need to clear that ring out a little bit. He doesn't want to enter to a full ring. We have seven in there right now. Tito still in it. Bruno, Hercules, Ali, E Rock. He's been in it for a while. Cody and I, Rob. One of these could be your Twitch champion. He said you'll come out when there's three left. He's going to take his time walking down. Is it going to be the champ? No, Jay Shade coming at number 17. We have three more left in this matchup for the Twitch championship. Bro, 
Ty, they're, they're on something else, man. They're on something else. You sure y'all not drinking the, the free punch? Jeez. Can't. Nice German suplex from Jay Shade there. E-Rock dumping Shade now across the ring. Cody stepping in. That is. That is. I'd love to see it. Hercules hang in there. Oh, man. We just saw E-Rock go flying. E-Rock out of the match now. His dreams of becoming the next Twitch champion have been shattered. Hercules now guiding Cody face first into the buckle. A little bit of snake eyes. Goofy says, hide under the ropes, Tito. Tito hitting that Spanish fly. Meanwhile, Ollie's setting up Jay Shade. Tito now stepping in for Ollie. Tito. Tito eliminated Ollie. Tito and Bruno now on the north side. Hercules with the neck breaker to Cody. Meanwhile, I Rob and Jay Shade. You said you made a mistake. If anybody wants to refund Icon for me, that'd be great. I don't have that screen up right now, to be honest with you. Benson Porter coming in at number 18. That means the champion is either 19 or 20. Thank you, Emma, for doing that. So the champion coming out second to last or last. Not a bad deal for the champion. Porter was making you claim that the title is theirs, though. Did I, Rob, just get rid of Porter? Porter is out. And another elimination. Hercules out. The champion is in. Tito is out. We have one entrant left here. Who holds that coveted 20th spot in this Twitch Championship Battle Royal? Or Royal Rumble, rather. There are six total left. One of these six will win it. Last entrance is Briggs. Is it? Is Briggs even in this match? Who's it going to be? What the fuck? What is happening right now? I am so confused. Well, one of them is out. It was a clone? I am so confused on what just happened. We had a clone. Is there Bruno eliminated by Cody? We're down to four. I can tell you who didn't come out that was part of our 20 I input. And that was you, Conair. Yuri was in this match. He's the only one on my list that didn't come out. And I had you my... Yeah. <laughs> so Yuri is owed a Twitch Championship match. He didn't make his entrance into this. So I can't... <laughs> he said, can I get a 1v1? Shit, we'll run that tomorrow. 
on the go-home show. We'll open with that. Twitch Championship. Champ versus Yuri. <laughs> Since he got screwed. Blue Brutes just take the glitch and move on. Irob in trouble here. Cody with the drop kick eliminating Irob. We're down to three. Cody, J Shade, and the champion. The champion could retain it here. Uh, Seth, no, you are not. So down to the final three. Twitch Championship on the line here. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't understand this game. And why two of the same people came out. Um, it's not the first time that's happened either. You want to make a return to the pay-per-view? Got to spend the cred, and you can make it happen. You and the capping. King here attempting to eliminate Jay Shed. Can he do it? Up on the apron. Shade is in trouble here. He's fighting through it, though. Crow, a.k.a. Shane Michael. Multiple champion. Back and forth here continues. Cody stuck in the middle. Are you the first to make a double? No, it's been done before. Crow just shaved. Sh sh he shaved Cody. Apparently he was hairy. He saved him, rather. Shane Crow saved Cody from getting eliminated there. I don't know if that was part of a plan here, but it's not looking good. Yeah, I think it happened to Yuri before. Either for or against him. I, I think it was in 22. And it's definitely not the, the first time. Right hand from the champion Shane here. Planning down Shade now as well. And Lana's online. Shane now planted out by Cody. A forearm strike to the spine. The champion in a dangerous spot. The champion is out. We are guaranteed a new champion. It'll either be... It will be Cody. <laughs> Cody has won the 20-man rumble and is your new Twitch champion. He'll be opening up tomorrow's show to face Yuri for that title. So Cody coming up short last week for the NAW Championship. Working his way back up from the bottom though here. Picking up a win for the Twitch Championship. So congratulations on your victory tonight here. For those that tuned in tonight for a little pop-up short episode, thank you so much. Tomorrow we have a bunch of matches and a lot of cool things scheduled. Also tomorrow afternoon, tune in for Thorne's first NPC episode. Uh, a lot of action tomorrow. This also means no shows on Friday this week because we've made up for them earlier today and tomorrow afternoon. Um, so yeah, tomorrow, go home show. Tune in for that promo, spin wheel, a lot of fun, a lot of stuff. Oh, we got a raid here as we're wrapping up. Oh man. Let's let's give some love to Rebel here. And this is a friendship, friendship, I'm a friendship that'll never ever Rebel A Rebel Raid. So thank you so much for the raid, Rebel. We're actually winding down our stream. So sad. 
everyone though check them out shout outs this is what they do for the raid give them some love they're playing pokemon it looks like that's cool we play pokemon too you could catch dc on tuesdays sometimes playing pokemon they get a cool little background we got the fire going i like it i like it he said now we do in dota e so there you go they do dota e too Tune in tomorrow night, 8 p.m. Eastern, though. Our go-home show will be back live with that. Shout-out to Rebel for the raid. We really appreciate the love. Give them a follow. And uh, if Rebel, all y'all can click follow our channel real quick right here. We'd love the support as well. No one likes the flames. What? I like the flames. I thought it was cool. Man. But ladies and gents, though, this has been episode 816 of NAW. We can catch you every single Thursday right here. Bonus to episode tonight. And then if you ever miss anything, we have a YouTube channel. We have a few of them, actually. Check out our YouTube. We're on social media as well. And a Discord. There's the follows. Thank you so much. I follow back, too, by the way. If you follow us, I follow you right back. So uh, give the love. We give it right back. Yeah, 800... 16816. Squid, it's all good. Check us out on YouTube. Again, we'll see you guys all tomorrow. And again, I'll, I'll follow you all back for the for the Raiders. Appreciate it. Y'all are the best. Until tomorrow, though, get some rest. We're gonna have a fun go home show tomorrow. I feel it. I feel it. And then in eight days, sacrifice our pay-per-view event. You're in the right place if you like NAW, if you like AI League Wrestling. If you want to join hashtag NAW23, we'll see you next time. Good night, everybody. Oh. Travis lit the house on fire! Oh, shit.